Now the different types of head technology that use these inks vary between manufacturers. Some of them are using a piezo crystal. A piezo crystal is when they put electricity on it, it vibrates, and it, that vibration is connected to a mechanical pump that's squirting ink out of a barrel, similar to ink coming out of a shotgun. The other technology is thermal. Thermal is a small resistor that when a drop of ink hits it, it turns on super hot, super fast, and instantaneously turns the ink to steam, and the pressure of the steam is what squirts the ink out of the nozzle. The advantage of a piezo crystal is the mechanical pump is that the mechanical pump almost all the time can clear out a nozzle cl clog. So if a nozzle ever gets clogged, it can always force it out. The problem with the thermal is that it's just steam, the pressure of the steam squirting out, so a lot of times they can have nozzle plugs and they can't clear them out. The way the thermal manufacturers have overcome that is that by adding additional nozzles. So they, they add hundreds and hundreds of more nozzles per color, and then on the fly they have an electric eye looking at the nozzles, and if one nozzle stops firing, they replace it with a different nozzle. Main problem with that is if you're firing color from a different location, it changes the color a little bit. But they've overcome this with real sophisticated algorithms that know it's coming from a different place and your eye can barely see that. The technology for that is just totally grown in leaps and bounds. But in the thermal technology, the, the heads are way more economical to produce and they make them user interchangeable. So usually when you buy a, a, a printer that uses thermal technology, you only have like a three month warranty in your head, but, you do, but it's user replaceable. Whereas the heads designed on a piezo machine, okay, those are designed to last three to five years and never have user replacement or user intervention. In fact, what they've even done with those heads now is they've taken and even put a chrome coating or like a mirror coating in the bottom of the head that virtually eliminates all type of head clogs.